Generation tip. I love leads, man. How about you guys? Lead generation is so much fun for me because in sales, we have to be meeting more people. So this is one that I directly used in my career that changed everything for me, man. And I had a lot of little ones. That's why we're sharing this. That just were freaking amazing, man. QR codes. These can be dangerous to your business. If you go to qrreader.com, you can input a QR form and you can make it say anything. You can make it say, how long have you owned this car for? Have you ever thought about trading this car in? How many months is this car financed through? Who the bank is? You can literally design it. Now imagine what I just said. I basically just said, how do I sell you a car without saying, how do I sell you a car? Okay. so. In a QR code, I would have these placed all over my service department. And it would literally say, like right where you're sitting in the lobby, you would just see a little QR form and it would say, we are giving more money than you could imagine on pre-owned cars that are serviced with us. If you'd like to know how, just scan the code. And then they would scan it and then they would write all the information in. My email would ding, boom, I got a little lead sitting right there. I even had such a great relationship with my service manager and my service advisors that I, they knew they got paid off the deals that I would put. So on my QR form, I put, I put well, which service advisor do you have? Do you have a current bill with service? Because that's important to the service advisors to know, right? You know, because some of them, they're getting paid on those, but some of the tickets they can't write because they're too much. The cars, they can't, they, they can't convert it for all kinds of different reasons, right? But it's important to know who that advisor was at their desk, I designed that QR code for each one of them. Service manager had his, each other guy had theirs. People would scan them. I know they just scanned it at Johnny's table. I know that's Johnny's customer. I can go up to Johnny and be like, hey, I just got somebody scan the QR code. You see them, where are they at? What kind of car do they got? Okay, cool, I see a little bit of that information. Dude, I'm gonna get this one for you, dude. I got you. If you could get your service advisors, and we got another service pro tip coming soon, right next after this, but if you can get your service advisors working for you, but you could also automate some of these touch points where they could get a little deal that's just scanned to them, man, you could change everything. So listen, my goal is to provoke a thought within you. You could have a couple of things that are set up. Hey, if your bill is too high, get it approved from the service manager. Hey, if your bill is too high, you can't afford it today, scan here and we'll go over some things that we do to be able to trade your vehicle out. And you can place those around. Also, last one that I'm gonna tell you about QR codes. Local partnerships. Man, I had all these local restaurants and I went to my general manager and I said, hey man, we always buy food on Saturdays. I'm always connecting people, right? I'm like, we always buy food on Saturdays. So, like, can we buy food from this restaurant owner? They bought a car for me, they're super amazing. And they're also gonna let me put my QR codes in their restaurant. Can we do that? He's like, yeah. And I'll never forget, that restaurant, I would get 15 to 20 scans a week. Dude, that's 100 leads a month, 100 leads a month. Dude, that would change some of y'all's life. They'd be sitting there eating their chips and salsa and they'd scan it because it'd say, hey, you know, customers, customers of Santiago's Mexican restaurant, you're gonna get an additional $500 and top market value on your car, scan here to receive your coupon. And then it was just a scan and then they'd get me. And by the way, I always took really good of those, really good care of those customers because they were local partnership people. They were local community people. I helped the restaurant. Now the restaurant loves me, and they're helping me build my business. So QR codes, dude, you can virtually put those anywhere. You could virtually walk around with one on your back. I had a guy walk in here in the lines den the other day. He had one on his shirt, and it said QR my booby, and it was right here on his shirt. He was wearing the same shirt as I'm like, man, I need a QR code on that, dude. Like, how cool is that? You could put one on your back. I see car dealers, they, they have their uniforms and they put them on their back. QR code, scan me right here. And it goes to them. It goes to their digital business card, which is another training. We're not going to get ahead of ourselves. Hey, QR code, implement that. Figure out ways that you can implement in your business just so you can get another, another relationship. Remember, we're always after relationships. We're always after creating more friends. That's what we're about. Let's go.